Okay, we're gonna go up this Travesa de Se and then we're gonna go up down this little mural area. But I just want to capture a little bit of what it looks like before we even go down. Because we have this, uh, this goes down to the Portuguese embassy, Portuguese consulate. And then this goes down to Sao Paulo ruins down that way and then Senado Square down that way. So we're just gonna give you a little context before we even go down. Love your channel, by the way. Oh, thank you. You're very cool. Thank you. Actually, oh, you filming? I am. Oh, sorry, I didn't want to bother you. No worries. Okay, Mikhail. Two zero two two. Filming the city street by street. Let's check it all out. Chiquinha. Chiquinha. Okay, so we're going to be going down this way. We just had kind of interesting conversation briefly. Uh, I don't know if I should mention their names. I, I, they're really interesting people. They were just talking. He was talking about how he uh, wrote a book. So I can't wait to see his book actually. And um, we were just briefly talking about Chinnery, just very briefly, which is where we're going to be going now. So I just, uh, I just have his image in there, but I won't say. I, I don't want to. Um, say anything about anybody unless they give me their permission to but uh, anyways really interesting conversation I, actually I will talk a little bit about him um, he, he wrote he wrote a book and that book is going to be published soon and it's about little aspects about Macau so um, I'm, I'll uh, definitely will read it and I'll probably um, show a little bit of it on the camera as well because um, that's the kind of stuff I like to do anyways is, is um, so I can uh, promote his book a little bit promote more Macau which I like to do as well and um, and kind of learn more about Macau as well myself and anyways this is our focus street right here which is um, <laughs> kind of funny because he was actually talking a little bit about Chinnery and this is the work that Chinnery did so he did all these watercolors and then they put them in these murals and this is also going to be our focus street today I'm just going to focus on the murals very closely and I'll tell you about Trinery. Um, I wish I knew about this work, but I know that definitely there's a big mix of like Portuguese and Chinese. So there's, um, and I don't know, I'm gonna have to read more details about him, but I will tell you that he was around in the 1800s. And there was before the, this is our street right here, Travesa de Mayo. It was before, there's another one right there. This is actually, I think this is, um, what's the name of that? There's the southern part of uh, Barra, it's near Barra. So in Barra there's a um, like a waterway that goes like that, that 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 used to be out into the ocean but now it's um, a man-made lake because they put they encircled it a little bit. But all of Chinnery's work was um, 1800s and then when he came out what happened was um, let me just kind of capture some of this. So when he came out, what happened was a lot of people from Europe started coming by and they would try to emulate his uh, artwork, his watercolors. And the reason they did this is because these were some of the some images of Asia and a lot of people were really interested in Europe because there wasn't, you know, photographs, photography and such. So that's kind of a little bit of a taste of, of Chinnery's work. And then this one we could go up to say, there's Boa Mesa. I think what I'm gonna do is just go up here, come back to the other side and just kind of try to link things together a little bit. So we're gonna be going up Say, and Say is kind of where we started. And then our little thing with the, with the murals. There's lots of cool stuff up here too. <laughs> oh, it's like this area too. I don't want to get too sidetracked. But this has these kind of cool balconies and it kind of goes in in a circle, square I mean. I do film in there from time to time. And then here, all these balconies up there. Okay, so we're gonna walk back down and down the street. This is kind of the Say area. 
and our murals were were down that way, so that's our focus, to so to say, it's kind of part of it. I'm gonna come back down. And it's just kind of see, it's called the Dream Corner. I think that's like a Catholic. <sighs> okay, so that's Chavisa to say right there. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna come back down again. Just kind of capture some of that. So, okay. So this is called Travesa de Mayo, and that will be our focus street. I, was, I guess you're just kind of coming to give me some context to it. So we saw Say, we saw Domingo. So what I'm gonna do is just go down this way a little bit. So basically, um, George Chinnery, there's also a George Chinnery Street. And I have filmed that sometimes and I kind of talk about it, but, but about 150 years ago, he was a British watercolorist and his work would um, um, influence a lot of people to come and, and paint in Macau. And those are some of his artwork. Pretty cool balconies right there too. Wow. Okay. Lemon series. Okay, so we're gonna come out and we're gonna end it up here in a moment. Travesa de Sao Domingos. We're gonna come out to Domingos. And um, yeah, those murals are up there at that Travesa de Mayo. And we're gonna come out to uh, Sonata Square in Domingos. I think this is kind of a nice ending spot. So that's uh, Sao Domingos, straight that way. And then, um, this is uh, Sao Domingo's church here. It's another square behind us. Sorry, I'm a little bit distracted, so. so okay. And there's uh, Sao Domingo's church straight ahead. It was pretty cool to meet that guy, Christopher. So, a pretty interesting guy. I always like to know more about Macau too, so that seemed like a guy that would know quite a bit about Macau. And he was kind of saying that he wishes he knew more, and I was like, yeah, I wish I was one of more myself as well. Okay, just trying to capture some of the scenery around here before we go. Okay, so I think I'll just keep the camera up a little bit and just kind of go back up to that spot. And um, and I guess uh, I guess I'll kind of give you a little bit more streets, and give you a little context and stuff as well. Yeah, this is a pretty beautiful area. m, &M Plaza. It looks kind of cool in there too. Nice balcony like that. Pop Mart. I just saw something about Pop Mart. About how much revenue they make through... through uh, some kind of tourism related thing. So yeah, kind of interesting. Capture some of these balconies as well. Okay, so we're gonna come back in full circle. And then we're gonna come back in this area. That goes up to Safala Ruins, Pop Martin, balcony. Then we're gonna end it back where we started at, which is right about here. So yeah, twisted to say, and then we did basically that Maya. 
I'm just gonna end it right there. Okay, Mikhail, two, zero, two, two. Filming the city street by street. Let's check it all out. Shikinya. Shikinya.